The favorite track of many of the drivers is one of the few remaining from the old guard. While more and more high-tech circuits are filling the race calendar, a lap at Spa leads about 7 kilometers through woods and over hills. And then there are the legendary corners too, like the hairpin la source at the very start, and above all, the infamous Eau Rouge. It's a spot that makes the drivers adrenaline pumping, year after year, lap after lap. At 300 kilometers per hour, it's down into a dip. Like on a roller coaster, the drivers are pressed into their seats, shoot down at top speed, and then uphill, seeing nothing but the sky. Once at the top, a long straight offers a little respite, if you can call it that, at 330 top speed. In Belgium, the challenging corner combination in particular separates the men from the boys. Wings need to be as low as possible and as steep as necessary. Otherwise, you lose lots of top speed on the flat out sections and through the fast corners. It gets really exciting in Spa whenever the typical Ardennes rain starts to fall. A whole weekend without a single drop of rain on the track is a genuine rarity. If the surface is wet, then the name of the game is easy on the throttle, especially as it's quite possible here for one part of the circuit to be underwater while another remains totally dry. But back to the track and it's off through bends 14 and 15 at 250, then flat out heading for Blanchiment, one of the fastest and longest corners of all. Only with the ideal line through this flat out corner are you fast enough to keep your nose on top approaching the bus stop chicane, which follows immediately, or to outbreak the car in front and gain a position before crossing the finishing line. The chance to do that comes every lap. From now on, therefore, a whole 43 times more.